Howdy folks, today we're dealing with a 1967 Leslie 147 cabinet. The owner brought it to me because it was uh, crackling and making noise. I went inside of it. It needs a few things, but uh, I found the crackling noise. Some um, Somebody with not a lot of experience went in there and tried to service the amp. They did a pretty poor job. They missed a solder joint and there was a loose wire and I found it and I fixed it. So I just thought you guys might find this pretty cool. I'll play my guitar through it. That's a, a custom, um, on the top there, that's a custom solid state amp. It's been modified with a special round pin jack that goes down to the Leslie cabinet. It powers the Leslie cabinet as well as the signal goes through there and there's a switch on it to control right in this area here. There's a switch for high and low speed. The default is low speed and uh, then you flip over to high manually with the switch. I'll play a few guitar licks for you and you can hear what it sounds like. I think it's pretty pretty cool. The reverb is a little bit noisy on this uh, head, but um, I'll get to that maybe later. Can't really hear the effect much quietly. switch sounds simple but it's a little technical um, there's 120 volts here that you're switching so I have to probably set up a relay I don't want to run 120 volts wall voltage 120 volts 15 amps out to a foot switch on the floor and then back to the, uh, the switch here uh, it's kind of dicey somebody could get hurt or electrified with 120 volts running out to the floor like that I think what I might do there's a little relay you can buy put inside and maybe just run um, like a wall wart into a plug, into a pedal on the floor, just like a regular guitar pedal, hit the switch, that'll send nine volts DC through into the amplifier here, into um, a relay inside, that'll remotely switch the uh, fast and slow switch. And then the owner could um, speed up and slow down at will whenever he wanted to to get the, uh, the best Leslie effect. There you go.